Oh, Hanatro's voice. Hello, everyone. My name is Dark Socks, and welcome back to another episode of Bleach Brave Souls. So, um, I I feel like I have some explaining to do about my character choice for who I put in front here because it, it is all Yamaji. <laughs> you see, I have new versions of him that I've never used before. So we're, we're just gonna see what they can do. Cause uh, I have four six star versions of him and I've only used one. And that was when I started the game forever ago. So we're, we're gonna see what he has to do. And I'm probably gonna pick a favorite and then sell the others once I have them fully leveled up. I completely forgot where I had to click there. <laughs> Because uh, my character inventory is a bit full. So yeah, we, we need to start being a bit more uh, selective with which characters we keep in. Chapter 139, A King and His Horse. Ichigo is fighting his inner self, whose name, who, uh, who is name, who is armed with a white zangetsu. The tide of battle is ebbing and flowing. Oh, no story straight into it, or is there gonna be a story? Okay. I must admit, it never ceases to amaze me how brainless you can be. You've lost your weapon. Why are you just standing there? Ichigo, what's the difference between a king and his horse? What the hell are you saying? If their form, ability, and power are exactly the same, why is it that one becomes a king and leads them into battle, while the other becomes the horse and carries the king? So what's the characteristic that distinguish distinguishes these two beings? There's only one answer. Instinct. I don't get it. I guess we're only going to see the big moves, if it's just boss fights. Anyways. You use your brain and try to win a fight. You attempt to defeat your enemies with the reason and logic. You don't tap into those pure base instincts that exist within your core, waiting to be released. And the simple matter is that... D and the simple matter is it doesn't work. You're weak, Ichigo. I won't put up with that. Am I clear? I don't know about Sangetsu, but I refuse to play a horse to a king who's weaker than me. Someone whose uncertainty and hesitation will end up getting us both cut to pieces. So if you aren't willing to assert your strength and retain the crown, then I'll destroy you, which means I'll be king. You do that, buddy. That was actually disappointing. I got nothing out of that. <laughs> Never mind. Chapter 140. Rematch. A battle for no reason. Ichigo was surprised to find himself face to face with Byakuya Kuchiki once again. How will Ichigo deal with Byakuya's sudden attack? Do Oh, we have the ninja guys. Wait a minute. This is Soul Society. But I was just fighting with... How did I... I put the thing on him so he's got a 50% 50% chance to hit hidden enemies. Can you hit the box, sir? Hello? Where is everyone? Oh, that was cool. Okay, I like this one. Pyakuya? What the hell is happening? Pyakuya? Pathetic. What are you talking about? Tell me what the hell's going on here. 
Answer me! Where are we? And why are you here? You're a disappointment, Ichigo Kurosaki. Huh? Bankai. Shirei Senbon Sakura Kageyoshi. Okay, that's actually very cool. Go Firegrams! Sorry, I had to dodge. Again, why is Byakuya the one that's always freakishly difficult to beat? Damn it. Byakuya, stop! This is no time to be fighting each other. Stand up, Ichigo Kurosaki. Byakuya, you're starting to annoy me. It is clear to me, Ichigo. In spite of your best efforts, I now see that it is impossible for you to truly use Bankai. Byakuya, you're out of your mind. I'm using Bankai right now, aren't I? This is crazy. I'm tired of all this nonsense, you jerk. The truth is, those who do not have the will to fight cannot deflect my blade. It's over. <laughs> oh, pony summer. Hi, Kenny. <laughs> Chapter 141 Those Who Yearn for Strength. Now it's Kenpachi who appears before Ichigo. As his reason for fighting is continually questioned, Ichigo doesn't have an answer for why he should fight a battle for no reason. What the? Where am I now? So, it looks like you're finally awake. Hey kid, thought you might be dead. What? Kenpachi? So you're next, huh? Kenpachi? Who the hell is that? Makes no difference, because I'm here to kill you. Okay, this dude has a mouthful to say. Also, this is the newest one that I got. He's the reason I wanted to use him, or all the different versions of him today. Not as flashy as the last one, but at least I have one of those things with the right attributes, so... It's a 100% chance of hitting hidden enemies. Why are you doing this? Cut it out! We settled things a long time ago. There's no reason for us to fight. Settled things? One thing was never settled. This is a battle with swords, not some fist fight. As long as one of us is still breathing, then this fight's not over. You're making this a fight to the death? Why? There's no reason. He's Kenpachi, that's his reason. You mean you need a reason to fight? Huh? Sorry, Kenny. Oh. As cool as that was, I think I like the second Yamaji the best. <laughs> Why don't you just accept it, Ichigo? You enjoy fighting as much as I do. What? You crave power. Isn't that right, Ichigo? And anyone who truly loves power loves to measure that power in battle. It's a simple fact. Question is, do we fight in order to gain more power? Or do we gain more power in order to fight? I haven't figured it out yet, but who cares? Because one thing's for certain, there's no reason we should ever deny it or try to change, because we were born this way. You've always wanted to fight, and you always will, Ichigo. For a second I thought we were going again. It's part of you. You do it instinctively. You have no choice but to fight because it's the only way to gain power. Fight, Ichigo. If you want to control that power, take your sword and cut down your enemies. There's no other path. 
No way to move forward or back. Fight, Ichigo. I just heard Eren in my head. Fight, fight, fight. Fight, 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 fight. <laughs> I feel like I'm in like my pre-high school days. You know when you see two kids, you're like, fight, fight, fight. <laughs> fight. Damn, what do you know? I guess I must have been wrong about you. Looks like you still have a little of that kill instinct after all. Fine, you defeated me. You've won the fight for now. I guess I've no choice. I have to accept you as the king. Still, I wouldn't want you to forget. While you're strutting around like a king on his horse, I can take that crown away at any time. I'll keep an eye on you, and the moment I sense the slightest weakness, I'll toss you to the ground, stomp on your skull, and crush it like an egg. Just one last piece of advice before I go. If you're serious about controlling my power, then all you have to remember is one thing. Don't get yourself killed before we meet again. I'm, I'm not going to do a funny voice there. What's going on? Hachi, get love out of the barrier now! He's looking perfect. He's looking pretty banged up. Do you think he'll be alright? So, how do you feel now? Fine. Not bad at all. Very good. Don't forget. I'll keep an eye on you, and the moment I sense the slightest weakness, I'll toss you to the ground, stomp on your skull, and crush it like an egg. Sorry to break it to you. That's not gonna happen. Okay, we are done with the visored training. Well, kinda done with it. Oh no, 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 no. No, 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 no. We, we will come back to what's going on in Orihime's room next week. Oh, wow. Only two actual fights and three stories. Nope, nope, we're not going to do it. I, I learned my lesson last time I tried to do too much. So we are calling it there. So yeah, that is it for this episode. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it. Let me know which one of the Yamajis you liked the best. Because I like the second one. He had lots of fire and flashy and fun. It, it was very entertaining to watch. But yeah, um, if you enjoyed this video, like it, leave me a comment. And if you're new and want to see the next episode as soon as it comes out, be sure to hit subscribe and book the bell. I'm posting main story stuff like this every... Uh, Shinigami Sunday and side quest stuff every Taicho Tuesday. I, in case you missed it, this past Tuesday I started the Zanpakuto story. It's the one I've been looking forward to doing the most. And yeah, send positive vibes so that I can get all of the Zanpakuto's characters to use for that because I want them all. I want them more than I want every single Pokemon. So yeah. Anyways, that is it. I'm gonna go, and until Tuesday, you just keep rocking.